Hey there Dev Squad, Virtus here and welcome back to my Unreal Engine 4 user interface development series. In today's video we're going to be showing you how you can set up functionality for an exit button. Now on our main menu you can see at the bottom here we do have an exit button. When you click that you want it to close your game and that is exactly what we're going to be showing you how to do inside of Unreal Engine. Now if you haven't got the latest version of the UI resources already with the exit button images make sure you do go ahead and download these. Once again the link for this is all in the description below. So what you want to do is grab your exit button and exit button pressed images and simply just import it into your content browser. From here what we're going to do is go into our menu and we're going to use this second button that we've already got. Now as you can see in the previous videos all I did was just duplicate the first button and then we've got this one up. So what we're going to do with this now is just quickly change the normal image. So the normal one is going to be our exit button instead with our normal image being the default image how it looks normally. Hovered is going to be our pressed button, so what we're going to do with this is just type in exit button pressed, which is the image we've just imported, and then last of all, we have just got our hovered, uh, or sorry, our pressed, which is when you click it, we are just going to use that tint and have it do that good stuff. So you can see we've now got a start button and an exit button. We don't have any functionality for this exit button yet, so let's go ahead and set this up. Now, what we're going to do with the exit button is create an on-clicked event. If you've got one already, just press view. And then with this, what we can do is fire off a command to close the game. And inside of Unreal Engine, it's really easy and really straightforward. In this case, for closing the game, we are going to execute a console command. A console command is something that you can essentially type in and has various functions built into the engine. So we can do things like exit or load a level and so on. Um, and if you click it, you can see it allows us to put in a command here. And the command for closing the game is pretty much self-explanatory. It's just exit. So if you set your command to exit, hit compile and press play, when you press your exit button now, you're going to see it's going to close down the game and if it was in a standalone window, it would close everything for you. So that is pretty much everything you need for an exit button. I'm going to keep this tutorial short and sweet because that is all we need to do. Just make sure your onclicked event is hooked up to the exit console command and we are good to go. Anyway guys, once again, thanks for watching, stay awesome, keep creating. Your boy Virtus, signing out. This video was made possible by my supporters on Patreon. If you want more videos like this, check out my Patreon page using the link in the description. To stay up to date on new releases, make sure you follow us on social media.